People ask me what I do if I make a mistake. Well, I fix it. In this case, I made a spelling error with gold leaf. I even outlined it. To fix it, first we remove the gold leaf with tape by ripping it off just like a band-aid. Next, I start rubbing down with a mild solvent to see what I can take off. In this case, not a lot came off. I then tried some harsher solvents, mineral spirits, and then lacquer thinner. Still not a lot of luck. So we moved to the oven cleaner trick. First taping off the areas that we're going to spray, laying some paper over the other areas, making sure that paper is not touching the leaf that I'm keeping, and then we spray it down. Find it best to use Easy Off's heavy duty cleaner. That doesn't mean it comes off easy. Take it down in stages, spray it, let it sit a couple of minutes, wipe it, neutralize it usually with something like water, or in this case I didn't have access to any, so I used a uh, glass cleaner. Unfortunately, I was out on a job and did not have access to rubber gloves. Rubber gloves are really important when you're using glass cleaner. This stuff is harsh on your hands. So instead what I did is every single time I wiped, I went and washed my hands with soap and water, trying to neutralize what's on my hands so it wouldn't eat into them. As you can tell, this process takes steps. Spray some, let it sit a few minutes, work on cleaning it, give it a little bit, spray some more, keep doing it, going back. I think I probably had to do it four or five times before it really started breaking down the enamels and the glue or the size on this job. I always worry what it'll do to the paint underneath, so I try to neutralize it with something as frequently as I can um, while working so not to mess up the paint underneath. It's possible it could fog that paint, soften that paint, do a number of things to that paint, so you do need to use caution if you try this trick. Eventually you will get it all off. Make sure that you clean the surface again very, very well so that your new paint sticks and doesn't have any kind of problems. The dullness you see in this area is because we wet sanded it and do plan on spraying clear coat over this later. So now it's back to the beginnings. Draw out your letters, lay down your size, lay down your leaf, brush off your leaf, spin it, outline, carry on as normal. This is just a quick little video, but hopefully it was helpful to y'all. Um, again, everybody makes mistakes. For me, I just try to figure out how to fix them.